Rachel Crenshaw didn't even realize that she was considered missing, that police were searching for her, and that there was even a candlelight vigil hoping and praying for her safe return. Now, that was two weeks ago. She got in a fight with her boyfriend on Flame Vine Lane at a friend's house. Something happened. They, they ended their relationship. She walked away. She left behind her purse, her cell phone. There was no way to track her. While well, police kept searching, they kept pursuing every possible lead. Well, it turns out she actually left that night. She met some strangers by the beach. She left town, did not contact anybody. She just returned to town yesterday, and a police officer spotted her early this morning around 3 a.m. walking by a neighborhood. We were at the, there was a candlelight vigil Sunday night at 6, Mid Florida Health. And myself and Lieutenant Pedersen attended, and we told them, I told them that day, that we were going to do all we could, and it didn't matter how much or what resources it took, and it never does, and it never will. And we told them that, um, that we were wanting to, to find her uh, and hopefully save. Now, by law, if you are an adult, you can disappear voluntarily if you want. It is not considered a crime. Reporting live in Vero Beach, John Zanitas, WPBF 25 News.